if you are an angular developer you must have worked with the forms there are two types of forms in angular angular reactive forms and angular template driven forms angular 15 angular version 15 has come up with many enhancement and added features in angular in reactive forms in this video i'm going to show you one of them that how effectively you can reset in angular reactive forms so to do that what i have done as you see on your screen that i have created one entity interface here title price and color there are three properties in that then i am using that here i am creating object of that and then using that to create a reactive form so here you see that i'm using new form group and then default value which i'm passing it is from this product object so pretty simple using new form group and then creating three form controls in that uh, of course you can use form builders as well to create form here but i'm using form group and then on the html i'm using that form group here uh, binding this form property binding to product form and then using these three controls right here right now when i go and run this app you see that form is created and default values of all form controls are set to uh, the value from product object paint 200 and rate when you say save product it is here saving it and you are getting that object here now the purpose of this video is to show you that how you can reset this form effectively so to uh, reset this form let's go ahead and uh, in the html we will add one button and let's say this button is called reset button and then on click event of this button we want to reset that for that we have already created one reset form function which i'm putting it here now what i'm doing here is that in reset form function just calling reset function of the form so it's pretty simple now let's go here and run this and when you say reset it you see that form is getting resetted to null values now this was always there and we have been working with that but angular 15 has come up with a added feature in reactive form using that if you say that hey if none nullable is true if you make none nullable property of a form control to true here so what i have done i have made null nullable property to true for all these three form controls that's it while creating that form and now when we go and run this app we say that okay pencil and we are changing this value and say that reset you see that it is resetting to the default value which you uh, set while creating that form so this is pretty simple keep in mind that now you can use none label true with a form control while creating form if you want to set use reset to set the value to the default value i hope uh, you like this video and you are enjoying using angular 15 thank you so much